We're at HR here in Las Vegas, and I got to meet Matt, and Matt was willing to talk to us about some really cool stuff in industry. So Matt, what is it that you do? So uh, I'm with uh, AccuTrack Ultrasonic Instruments. We make listening devices that hear the sound that, leak makes, that leaks make, and that allows the technician to find them. So ultrasonics is pretty unique because it works with any sort of gas. It could be R22, 134A, it could even be compressed nitrogen or a vacuum. They all put out the same sound signature, and this technology will let you scan for leaks no matter what gas is in your system. So that's really cool. So instead of having to put refrigerant in and have something to sniff for, or put refrigerant in and worry about the nitrogen pushing it to the other side of the system, I can pick up a leak, whether it's refrigerant or if it's just plain dry nitrogen. That's right, and that's, that's one of the fundamental problems of leak detection. You have a system that's leaking, and you're putting more refrigerant into the system just to find that leak, and that's expensive and hazardous to the environment because you know it's leaking to atmosphere. With this system, you can charge a system with nitrogen and begin your leak test, and it's the only technology that can hear a leak with nitrogen leaking out. You could also pull a vacuum on a system and then begin your leak test then because the vacuum puts out the same noise that a positive pressure leak would. Interesting. So how does this thing work? So uh, in our demo here, we're going to fill a coil with compressed air, okay. and we're going to show you how easy it is to find a leak using ultrasonics. All right. So we'll start by turning on this compressor and adding about 20 PSI to this coil. Okay. And that's a significantly lower pressure than you'd normally test at. A technician might have a system set up with 100 or 200 PSI, because the higher the pressure, the more ultrasound you're going to create, and the more Excellent. effective the instrument is going to be. Okay. But this is good for a demonstration. So this so is we, a small, this would be a leak in most systems you come across. It's a very low amount right there. Absolutely. And you'll notice this will hold its pressure the whole time we're shooting here. There's no air tank. So the leak that's in this coil is very tiny. Okay. It's actually buried in the coil, so it's a very difficult leak to find. Okay. But we're going to use AccuTrack and we're going to scan over and we're trying to listen for the sound that the leak makes. So you have this attached to a speaker. I'm going to put the speaker right. closer to the mic here so we can Excellent. hear what, you guys can hear what we're hearing right here. Great. So you turn on the instrument and using it as a simple as scanning. So we're just going to run the instrument over the top. And we're going to wait for a signal. And oh, you can, wow. And you can hear that. Okay, is that it? That's it. So that's literally the sound of the gas rushing out of the heat. And it's that easy. And so again, it doesn't matter what type of gas that is. And that's why it's so effective. You can fill a system with nitrogen and leak test that way. Well, that's, that's pretty cool. Now, I haven't ever got to use one of these in the field. I've always wanted to. So when I get to the expo, this is one of the top things on my list that I wanted to go see. Now, Matt, have we met before? We have not. We no. have not. Only I just know about their ago. product <laughs> by reputation. And we just met. There's no monetization connection here whatsoever. It's a really cool product I wanted to share with you. And Matt, you're really knowledgeable. Really appreciate your time on this. Sure. Do you have any advice for anybody coming into the trade or getting started in the trade? You know, you know, absolutely. I'll, I'll stick with leak detection here. I mean, there we consider this a complementary technology to some of the existing methods out there. So you know, we don't tell you to throw away your soap and bubbles because there's always going to be a time when when using soap or another technique might be the best for the for the moment. But we believe that this is an excellent tool for the toolbox. It could save you a lot of time, and you know, having technology like this along with other technologies can really you know, lower your hours out in the field and, and, and make your business more profitable. So we encourage you to give it a shot. That's pretty cool. I love that honesty. And that's the right thing, the right tool for the right job. And having understanding how the tool works and its limitations, this is one of those things I've always wanted. Can't wait for the day I get to try it in the field. But Matt, I really appreciate your time. Right, absolutely. Thanks for talking about Thank this. Thank you.